to victory. This must be the railroad. It would appear so. Likely part of Denver's old system. This city was a major transport hub in the early years of freight trains. This particular this line lesson. appears to have been abandoned some time ago. It was originally constructed to transport supplies to an underground factory. But now, it seems even the electrical system is no longer functioning. Yeah, it's pitch black in I have to believe they just abandoned the somewhere like this. I, this I guess there are just abandoned tube stations everywhere. So. London. So I guess it could be happen. Oh, oh come on. Ah, I suck at stealth here. Yeah. There we go. That's the kind of parry I like. Get off. The perfect kind. You spin things around, slam them on the ground, and slice them in two. One clean cut. I guess they're kind of like cutting out their hands and kind of slicing them in. Who cares about that? <sighs> that is kind of weird. I don't know, just like. They were just like, you know what this need this game needs? A weird pitch black stealth level. Get off. I mean I guess there's no like consequence for getting anything wrong, but it's still weird. I guess we have to jump on this box and then jump up and do the um air stealth kill because you can do that at any point in the air maybe not ah wrong button oh yeah and there's there's also gecko all along the ceiling Dwarf Gecko, I should say. I can't see shit. <laughs> All I can see is the gore. Really, when you turn it off, it stays... Oops. When you turn the... Your night vision, the little augmented view mode on. I think that, like that does. I think there's an achievement for getting through here without getting seen, but it's such a pain in the ass. I can't be bothered. I like stealth, but the stealth in this game is just kind of awful. Yeah, look, okay, you can see here because you're in the augmented vision, but you turn it off, you can still see for a while, and then it fades. It's like the opposite of what your eyes do in the dark. I mean, like, I mean, Raiden's vision is augmented anyway, but still. I think you get along with uh, JC Dayton and Adam Jensen, and whoever the fuck the guy from Invisible War is. I still haven't got around to playing that game. All the people telling me it's shit, like, I never really bothered. Get off. Anyone watching gonna chip in on that? Deus Ex and it's, uh... Not 
that, so worthy sequels, sequel, and it's very worthy of a sequel, or prequel I guess I should say. Just gonna take out these geckos because I can't. Because for some reason, the people in here are almost completely deaf. And there's a weird, there's those weird two geckos standing on top of each other thing there, but you don't want to go near that actually. Those are legitimately quite hard to destroy, and they can hurt. They can, like shove you. Hurts for some reason. Oh no, I got seen. Oh well. Yep, and uh, now he can't see me anyway, so. My neck. Can I kick him out? Nope. My controls disconnected again. That's irritating. This game is super sick, man. It's so good. Fuck it, I'm fighting him. Just I can't be able to stealth it. Hey, free kill. I'll put you by luck, honestly, but yeah, I think they limit the uh, amount of times you can do. This move is so good for clearing out dwarf geckos. Bane, Bane, E. That might actually be my first A. I've got S's, I've got B's, and I've got C. I got C's, and I've got a D. I don't think I got an A until now. Kind of interesting. Man, I wonder what Revengeance turns the uh, room with three gorillas into, because that room's already really annoying to deal with. Lower difficulties. Right. It would it's about this size room, three of those big gorilla guys, and they constantly jump off you the wall and smack you. Where are all the civilians of the night one hostage? Proceed to the right from the exit. You will find a stairway on your right. Those uh -oh. stairs lead to Just a shortcut to World Marshal Headquarters. Kick Do not box. be distracted by the advertisements. You are not here as a tourist. Sure. I'll just buy a quick souvenir or two for Rose and that'll be it. Raiden, we must hurry. Remind me to teach you about sarcasm sometime. I understand your attempts at humor. I simply do not find them entertaining. <laughs> I don't I don't want to find that joke funny, but I do. I kind of shredded that. That's in a lot more paces than it looks. <laughs> right. You have almost reached World Marshal Headquarters. Uh -oh. oh yeah, this is actually kind of funny how you like solve that 
thing shooting up you up at you up there. That's how we're doing it. Here comes the grad. Way too early. Not that time. Should get a decent ranking. And that's most of them. This also tears apart grads, I just remembered. Riding could deflect, uh, you could deflect bullets without running in this game. Um, really annoying asset, facet of this game. And you have to run to deflect bullets, which means that if an enemy is. Essentially. Oh shit. Raiden is good enough to deflect the bullets himself, but will only do it when he has to show off. What a dick. Ah, I'm not sure, sure what's stunned him, but I'll take it. Yeah, I'll take it dead on, sure. Makes about as much sense as anything else I say. No! Yes! I actually fucking got it! <laughs> More points for Jamie. No, more points for this ninja. Yeah, I think that boss fight's now kind of conditioned me to be... Have, have a decent, you know, not really find these guys too hard now, because, frankly, nothing's going to be as hard as fighting those two in a tiny room. dead. Kinda like how he uh, yells enough when you kill him. Even even Raiden's pissed off the amount of HP they gave those things. Ah. It didn't give me a... Oh, there we go. Weird. Give me an A. Enemy nice. Avoid fighting if you can. Oh man, if you want to avoid fighting here... Oh, I know, fighting down here is not too bad. It's the point where you come back. You go along this way the opposite direction. It's almost impossible to avoid conflict. And there's a fucking hostage. So you actually are meant to. Wow, this is tearing him apart. What oh, no, no, this dead already? Jesus. Why am I not using the Tron gym more? Stranger I rem 
stranger it remains no longer. Wait, come back. You must have your spine. Thank you. Oh ho, I'm glad I came down here. Got HP. Whoops. I mean, dodging in this game kind of finicky. Gotta press two buttons at once. The uh, justification is that it's actually also counts as an attack. Oh wow. It's actually making him flinch. Making a cool noise. Three hits! I always find it weird that you put a uh, combo counter in here when the Tranja is in there in this game, which basically does that and makes every combat gain at least 100 hits. Fuck you, I'll do what I want. I mean, I'll head there, but not because he told me to. Oh shit. I want to attempt to do this stealthily. And by stealthily, I mean I'm going to shoot a guy with Nah, raises a lot. Oh well. Whew. No. Oh, fuck me. Ow. Oh wow, I mashed the control so hard I un unplugged it. It's probably a sign I should stop playing soon. After the monsoon battle. Should be at the end of this level. Call it a night. Oh, I might call it a night now. My controls are actually getting recognized. There we go. It made a noise again. Now I'm suspicious. Why is, why is that an appropriate song? It's not. Send your taste buds a mile high. A taste of Denver. Sadly, that's the only slogan they have. That was a bit shit, I guess. They didn't see a thing. Oh. Oh, you just get You get seen by the Fenrir, so it doesn't actually matter. Burn! Seriously, yeah, she's actually a pretty fucking sick burn. Well, that's what's going on. He's doing that move. 
No, 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 no! Fuck, thank god I had that thing. What happened? What is going on? What did happen? Answer me! Right my, my feet blew up. Hiding in a box is surprising. This is like the the Metal Gear Solid game where this is actually the most effect. This is most effective. It works in other MGSs, but look at this! Look at look at this! This is just stupid. Some quite badly clipping into this uh, these stairs. I guess they never expected anyone to actually use stealth. Nobody's looking. Ah, occasionally weirds out. Really doesn't like you executing people on slopes. Why they make it so you can execute people on slopes, I don't know. The only time you really don't fight on flat plane is during stealth segments. Raiden particularly enjoys you pointing a railgun at him, considering what happened last time someone pointed a railgun at him. I was in just two. Worst day of his life. Shit. How did this happen? How did all of them explode? And just die? There's still a femora somewhere. Oh, I killed it, apparently. Huh. Wait. I'm imagining things. I thought I heard a phone ringing. There. Just one of the two femoras. Guess I must have just killed it by accident. <gasps> Don't worry, miss. You shall be free! See, that I'm used to. That's more Kojima like. Even though Kojima had very little input in the game. Hey, Sam! Jetstream Sam. I have a bit of the London Rector in half. Old habits die hard, eh, Jack? But now here you are. The child soldier. Fighting for the children. <laughs> Please. What do you really expect to accomplish here? Play savior to a bunch of brains? And what? Earn a medal? And the politicians, certainly not the average job. Too busy fretting for money, for sex, religion, fame. Is that the end of your little speech for now? Do I have to continue into the well, that was a cool noise. Don't know what it was. Okay, I gotta continue to hear for this cutscene.
I mean, he has a point. He's been a massive hypocrite. My sword is a means to an end. To protect those you'd prey on. Really? Let me ask you. All those cyborgs you've killed up to now, maybe they weren't kids, but they were people. You ever think about them? When you're chopping them into hamburger? <laughs> they're adults. They made their choice. Sure they're adults. Sure they signed up for this. Right on the dotted line of their BMC contract. Usually they're no strangers to war. In fact, many times they already lost a limb or two. Many In some ways, this makes a better point about transhumanism than Deus Ex did. So yes, which is kind of weird. They sign up for surgery to fight God knows where. How else would you provide for your family when your country's embroiled in civil war? Pain receptors shut down, pumped full of fear inhibiting nanomachines and sent right into the blender. Your blender? But they made their choice. That's what the kids are calling it these days. Open your eye and see, Raiden. I've seen plenty. Then listen. Those battlefield emotions that the nanos press. Listen to them. What are you talking about? Oh, I love Jetstream Sam. He's so, like, over the top. Can we take so fiat- not over the top, theatrical. It's the same dude I just killed. Like, don't let me die. I I literally this? killed this dude, the guy with the moustache. After the car exploded. Whoa, that was heavy. point's kind of weird when you remember that from MGS2 onwards, the game they introduced right and you had the option of not killing people. You only actually kill, have to kill two people in the course of MGS2. And they're both kind of weird, because you can still take them out in non-lethal means, the game just counts it as one. Stop it! during this scene, but, like, I don't know. I can't really do this. Oh, are you kidding me? It's just because I didn't hit him enough. Raiden, are you injured? I thought they had a choice. A fair choice. Not like you. People are different. As opposed to AIs? You're all the same, huh? You and your brothers. Manipulating mankind for our own good. It appears just, just imagining liquid talking here. You. I apologize. Uh, no, it's. I know you're right. As for AIs, we adapt as we learn, just as any intellect operates, man or machine. Altering the course of mankind is not among my divine directives. I guess that's a relief. Samuel's behavior does not match established parameters. You know him? Affirmative. I haven't actually played the DLC. I'm definitely gonna load that up when I'm done with this. Maybe not on Revengers, because I don't actually know what to expect. You think highly of him. I have always found him dependable. Until now. Scouting data for the next area. 
I'll patrol ahead. You follow. There's the bit where I can't like actually fight. Riding it is. Your current emotional state appears highly volatile. I am sure you do not intend to abort the mission, but I suggest you avoid combat for the time being. Oh sweet, I get to show you guys a cute little easter egg. Yeah. Well, it's just coming up. Also coming up to Monsoon, which... Oh, I love Monsoon. Just like, for his, the design they gave him. It's so cool. Why is that just a fire extinguisher in the middle there? Either way, really, this is how I fight right now. Not fun. Can't even parry. I think. Actually, I might be wrong in the parry part. This boss fight, yeah, the upcoming boss fight, I really like the character. I really like his, well, I don't know, the character's kind of boring. But uh, his design and his general nuttiness is really fun. And, uh, I'm thinking Michelangelo Police, aka Chemical X, aka Victor Von Doom, will definitely appreciate it. Or any students of physics, really. We'll appreciate this boss fight for the shit he spouts during it. Does it rain this much in Denver? I I actually don't know. Like, what the, I know it rains a lot in Seattle, but I don't know where Denver is. I have a much higher proportion of physicists watching this than most people. You can't actually avoid getting seen here, as far as I can tell. I'll try. Nope. Wow. <laughs> yeah, no, I can't die here. Thoughts, if it's like the jet stream stam fight, the initial one. There he is. There's the man of the hour. Jet stream Sam. I think it is actually possible to kill these guys, but probably not in revengeance. They have too much HP. Hey, buddy. Is your cause just? Or is that just what you tell yourself? Fuck you. 